What's up guys, g here and welcome to a new series where we're going to be combining the hybrid score builders and player reviews. So I think it would be a pretty cool idea. Uh, but guys, remember if you're looking for ultimate team coins, go check out utcointrails.com, link will be below in the description. So we're starting things off with the uh, one and only man of the match, Robert Lewandowski. Um, but guys, I really, really do hope you enjoy this as I've, I kind of wanted to do some player reviews. But then again, I like doing hybrid score builders and this is a really, it's probably the perfect way of combining the two. Uh, so if you do enjoy the video at any point, make sure to thumb the video up. Uh, if this get 1,000 likes, that'd be awesome. And um, the other thing is, uh, big thanks to Propane Games for allowing me to borrow uh, Lewandowski. He actually let me borrow uh, Thomas Miller the other day. And uh, again, kind enough to let me borrow Lewandowski. So go check him out. And uh, another thing, um, make sure to comment below uh, a player you want me to cover next episode or next uh, video of this. Um, I currently haven't got a name for this series. Uh, I had like pick a player or something like that, but I have no idea what to call it. Also, leave some suggestions in the comments below. But as you can see on the screen, there are his in-game stats. He is one crazy mole foe. Look at them, like they're all green pretty much, and uh, it's absolutely incredible. And uh, he is 87 rated then, so go a bit of information about him. He got his man of the match card for getting four goals against uh, Real Madrid in the Champions League semi-finals, which uh, I watched it, and uh, they're all good goals. He got a penalty in one of them. Uh, they're still well and calmly slotted. Um, but the go over the team as well, um, I had a few, a fair few informs, and he's a 3 5 2, so obviously it'd be a strong squad from the start. Uh, but his in game stats then, he has got 91 ball control, 99 finishing, one of the few players that actually has that now. 87 heading, 87 long shots, 98 shot power, which is insane, especially with that finishing and long shot stat. Uh, 88 dribbling, so he's close dribbling, 86 short pass, 94 volley. So his shooting stats, they're all pretty much 90 plus, uh, apart from that long shot, which is only 3 short. 85 acceleration, 95 reactions. So he's on some uh, them triple X crosses uh, straight away and in an instant. He has got 82 strength, 84 agility, uh, 90 jumping, and 85 sprint speed, which is for some. I think he's six foot tall, and uh, he's always in the right place at the right time. But like I said, this is a hybrid score builder mixed with a player review, so it gives me the opportunity. Um, because with player reviews, I find that I pass the ball to the player I'm trying to get the review um, done for. Uh, I pass it to them too much and don't play properly as a squad. So this gives him more uh, a more a clear opportunity of showing you what he would be like in a normal squad. And uh, he's also got three star skills, four star weak foot, and uh, he's also got high high work rate, so high attacking, high defensive, uh, which can be quite quite a uh, letdown for some players, but not for him. Uh, fortunately for me, um, the team overall was very very strong, the very solid in defence, and on the counter this squad was is, is ridiculous to play with. Um, only lost two games out of I think ten overall, including friends matches, which is pretty good going uh, for me. Um, but who was in the team then? We had second inform Mandana from this week's team of the week. Inform Bakary Sanya at centre back. Inform Koscielny. Normal Vincent Company, as I don't feel the uh, the inform is much of an upgrade at all, really, after using him. Second inform Mertens, the uh, normal nine go, and he has actually got an inform, but what a player he is. And then we've got Zanetti. Uh, inform Eric Lamela. Uh, inform Palacio at Cam. Then out front, we had Marco Royce linking up with man and match Lewandowski. And, uh, Marco Royce and Lewandowski. R1, hell of a combo. Royce has got the pace and the skill, and uh, the, I scored some ridiculous goals with Royce towards the end of this. So that, that advanced rainbow to uh, volley there. Pretty nice going. And uh, also, this uh, this is a bit of a spicy goal here. Gets a bit of sp uh, a spoon, gets a bit of room, and smashes that top corner uh, from the little German himself. The uh, next thing, I'm going to be covering the pros and cons and the overall that I'm going to give each um, this the, the selected player, which is Lewandowski himself. Uh, but nevertheless, we'll go into the last, uh, last clip, and this is... Uh, a decent near post OP shot by Marco Royce. But the uh, the th first thing I'll cover is going to be his pros. Uh, the pros, he is a deadly finisher. He is in a great league. The Bundesliga is probably one of the strongest leagues on FIFA on the team. He's very, very strong. Very, very, very close dribbling. He's great in the air. 86 heading. Uh, that's probably why. And he is a massive upgrade from his non inform. Um, I believe he got like plus seven or something shooting. Uh, probably even more than that. Uh, the only con, one of the two cons there, uh, is price. Uh, I showed his price in the in-game stats part. Uh, on the Xbox, he's averaging over a million coins at the moment. PS3, just under a million. And uh, obviously, Royce is as good, in my opinion. Royce it, Royce is incredible for, like, in striker, you get him for about 10k now. Uh, so, obviously, obviously, there are better alternatives. But the overall rating I'm going to give him is a 9.4 out of 10. Value for money, 4 out of 5. And quality, 5 out of 5. Uh, for me, he's one of the best strikers I've used. Uh, he's very, very good on the ball. Very, very good off it as well, making them runs. And he's one of the most deadly finishers on the game, guys. So if you've enjoyed this video, make sure to hit the thumbs up button and the like or whatever. Just call it the like button. And uh, make sure to comment below 
a suggestion for the name, name of the series and also a player you want me to cover next episode guys. So thank you for watching video, please like, please subscribe and I'll see you guys next time.